case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1996, the United States Court of Appeals for the Tenth Circuit heard the case of Cartoons, LCV Major League Baseball players Assen, which centered on the balance between First Amendment rights and property rights. At issue was a dispute between Cartoons and the Major League Baseball Players Association, MLBPA, over parody trading cards featuring caricatures of baseball players. Cartoons produced a set of 130 cards, which included comical and mocking portrayals of both active and retired players, as well as political and sports figures, accompanied by humorous commentary on the back. The MLBPA claimed that Cartoons was violating the players' property rights by using their names and likenesses without permission. The lower court initially ruled in favor of the MLBPA, but later issued a declaratory judgment in favor of Cartoons, recognizing a parody exception to Oklahoma's right of publicity statute. MLBPA appealed the decision, arguing that the district court lacked jurisdiction over the case. However, the Tenth Circuit Court exercised jurisdiction, focusing on the question of whether the right to free expression under the First Amendment outweighed the right of the MLBPA to control the use of the players' names and images. Ultimately, the court ruled in favor of cartoons, holding that the company had the right to create and sell parody trading cards despite using the players' names and likenesses without permission. The decision affirmed that First Amendment protections for free speech were more important than the MLBPA's right of publicity in this case. The court determined that cartoons did not violate the law by producing and selling the parody trading cards. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.